Hey everyone, I got some requests to do a little bit deeper dive on the mood, so I'm not going to go into all the different things that this pedal can do, but I will show you the different ways that I use it. Um, if you don't know already, there's two sides to this pedal. Um, there's the reverb, delay, and slip side on the old blood noise side, and then there's the envelope, tape, and stretch on the drollo side. I use pretty much everything except the, sh the uh, envelope mode. Uh, I haven't really found a, a use for that yet, but we'll just jump on in. So one of the settings I use a lot is a big reverb with the tape side, and I'll have the modify, I'll have it being ramped. So let's get something in, so let's get something in the looper. Uh, I'm going to have this just listen to the input signal and then I'll double it up by having the looper listen to the wet side as well. So. So I'll use that one a lot. This is just in mono, usually I'll add on a stereo reverb or delay, but for the sake of consistency in the video, we'll, I'm just gonna leave uh, the mood in mono so you can actually hear what the pedal is by itself is doing. Um, the next mode I'll use is slip. I'll use this one quite a few times too. I'll do an octave up or an octave down. This is an octave down reverse. So that's 100% uh, octave down. I'll do the same thing with the octave up. So that's a uh, slip mode I'll use. Uh, on, the other side, on, on the other side, I'll use the stretch mode a lot. Um, I'll use this in conjunction with that preverb I was using before. So um, on this, I, I'll just have it listen to wet side, just listen to the looper. I won't double it up um, like before. So let me get something in stretch mode.
also great for pad kind of things too. So let me try this same kind of thing. I'll do a different pattern. Um, another thing I'll do is I'll use it as a double looper um, using the delay mode. So I'll go to the delay. Um, what's cool about this is if you set the repeats to the max, it'll keep going forever, but it won't ever oscillate. So let me find a use of delay time. I'll set a long clock. I also have a trails mode on, just why it does that. So I'll loop something in the looper mode side first, and then I'll do the looping, or I'll do the delay side. So uh, I'll do something in tape mode. Just listen to the input. Let's set max repeats. Also, what I like to do on the looper side is I'll mess with the, sometimes I'll modify or I'll ramp the length knob. Let me do something really quick. So you can add a sort of trim sound with the with chopping up the, the length knob on the tape side. And then using a looper in conjunction with any side. So we'll go back to the slip mode. Thank you. 
Also, um, forgot to mention, uh, I'll, I'll ramp the mix knob along with the modify knob. So if I go to, I'll go back to the first setting uh, with the reverb. Get a kind of higher clock setting. <laughs> Then I'm going to ramp the mix knob. Just so you can hear this in context, I'll put on a big reverb. So yeah, those are some of the ways I'm using the mood right now. There's so many different things. Um, I might do a part two if I discover some other things that I can do. But if you have any questions, let me know in the comments. And thanks for watching.